Everyone, don't forget to like. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and give us a subscribe, please. Thank you. Well, guys, um, <clears throat> sorry my throat is really sore. Um, I uh, told my mom a little bit about what was going on in Vegas, and uh, it turns out I'm going back. So, uh, at first I was debating if I was even going to go back now or go back later, but she told me she can help me uh, with this like freight company, this like towing freight company, and they're basically going to come here and uh, put the Honda on a freight and it's going to go to Vegas and I can just drive this car here But I got to give this car an oil change and once I do that, uh, I guess I'm good to go and I can go back to Vegas, so um, Let's just see how the rest of the day goes though. I don't really count my eggs until they hatch, so I'm sorry guys. it has been a lot of stress on my head lately. Oh, man. This has been rid ridiculous. Um Let's just wait and see. Um, let's just wait and see. I haven't um I don't count my chickens before they hatch, so let's see. I'm bringing you guys along for the rest of the day. Let's see. Wish me luck. Just sitting here on the street, guys, waiting for the guy to come pick up my Honda, so I'll wait and see what happens. I don't know. I'm just sitting here waiting. Patiently waiting. He said he'll be here tonight, so um, I'm just going to sit here, figure out what's going to go on from there. Wish me luck, guys. So guys, it is the next morning, um, really tired, I didn't sleep too much. Um, I found out that I have to get the car some oil before I make the drive. Um, I'm not even sure what I said yesterday when I was filming that stuff, but the, the guy was supposed to come and get the car, the, the Honda, and um, which is on this street too, by the way, and I don't know... Um, I don't know where where he, when he's coming. He said he was gonna come yesterday, and and he called me today saying he's gonna be here this afternoon or like around lunchtime. So we'll have to wait and see. Um, but like I said, I gotta go get the car some oil. So we gotta go get that done first. I'm gonna change the oil in the car. So let's go. Us uh, walking in AutoZone, guys. Let's go get some oil for the car. Oil over here. Where's a 10W30? They don't even... Oh, there it is down there. There it is down there. $38.99. Well, that's... More money than I thought. Yeah, Walmart's cheaper, but here we go. Alright, guys. Got my oil and my oil filter. And I'm going to be changing my oil right now. Just get this thing ready to go. Everyone hasn't seen the new brake system. Look at that beauty. Just had that put on a couple weeks ago, it cost all my damn money, but it was worth it because now the car actually stops. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and change this crap now and hopefully the guy will be picking up the Honda sometime in the mid-afternoon. I'll be going back to Vegas later on uh, in the afternoon, late night. So here we go. All right, got my car all taken care of oil now, guys. Should start up just fine. all that new oil all right guys I'm tired of shit I got the oil change in the car now but I just got a confirmation from when I was changing my oil actually uh, the place that's moving the Honda to Vegas called me and said they're probably not gonna be there till be here about 8 o'clock tonight so now I gotta wait another day well basically another day I hope I hope I can start driving towards Vegas today guys we'll just have to wait and see how everything goes but here we go I'm gonna pass some time at Target guys while I'm waiting for all this stuff to bypass on the way into Target it's gonna pass some time guys while we're waiting for all this stuff to happen today ah we're almost there <laughs> Just walking to Target because I'm just killing some time waiting for uh, waiting for the you know everything to happen for today and standing here looking at some Pokemon cars, man. They're not really, they're not really selling like they used to. They got all the new like the new Sun and Moons, but that's about it. There's some stuff here. They don't have any like, booster boxes or nothing. They just this is all they have, huh? So here's some more funny shit that happened, guys. Just like the other day when I was filming and I got thrown out of the damn mall. I was literally, I walked into the Target. You guys saw me with the camera. 
And I guess the, the security camera saw me outside filming and the guy's like, um, hi, are you videotaping? And I was like, oh, not at this moment I'm not. I did outside though. He's like, oh, well, you can't film anything inside the store. And I was like, yeah, okay. Well, I didn't film inside the store. I did. It's weird. Like, I don't understand people. I swear there's a video on, on the YouTube channel. Guys, correct me if I'm wrong. I swear there's a YouTube video of us at the, uh, the Target in Vegas. And we're walking around that store with this same camera, walking around for like 40 minutes, and no one bothered me. It's just weird. But anyway, I'm just going to go drive around and have some fun. I'm not going to let people try to ruin my day. It's, it's actually, guys, it's turning around to be a better day. My car is driving great ever since I gave it an oil change this morning. Let's go have some fun, guys. I'm taking you guys along with the ride me. Let's go, everybody. I love you guys. Let's go. Hey guys, so it's uh, about 7 o'clock right now. Um, God, the guy with the freaking freight tow truck thing, whatever, should be here in about an hour. I have no idea, but um, I don't think I'm going to be able to leave tonight. I'm really, really freaking tired. Um, I don't even remember what I said to you guys. I was like sitting here. I came over to this side of the town. I just like fell asleep in the car. and I'm just like really, really, really freaking tired, guys. It's been a long freaking day. Um, but yeah, I just, I'm going to keep giving you guys updates as it comes. I don't know. I don't know when the guy's supposed to get, he's supposed to get here at eight, but if he's even going to show up, I'm sorry. I'm like so freaking tired right now. Um, let's keep you guys updated as much as we can. Hopefully I don't doze off again, but I don't think, I, I don't think for sure that I can do this. I have to wait until tomorrow morning. This is so weird guys. Cause usually when I record something for you, it's usually all within the same day. And this video, this video is literally like yesterday, today, and tomorrow, all in one video. Because it's just, it's literally one thing that's taking me so freaking long. And I don't understand why it's taking so long. Hopefully we'll get this crap all sorted out though, guys. Because it's really just, uh, it's a mess. But it's not that big of a deal. You know, I just, I don't know. I, I'm just trying to be pest. I'm just trying to be optimistic. Not pessimistic, stupid. <laughs> Guys, you can tell I haven't been sleeping. Oh my god, I'm just like really freaking tired and oh well, you know. Ah, that's the way it goes. So anyways. Uh, I'm taking you guys along for the ride. Hopefully he gets here by eight. We'll see. Got time the damn tow trucks here, guys. It's fucking 10:30 in the morning. Or 10:30 at night. About time. Ah. Couldn't see you there. How you doing? Are you uh you're picking up the Honda? Yeah. Okay. Hey, bro, you got. What's that? We don't transport household goods, man. So. What's it called? We don't transport stuff that's in the car. We only transport cars. We don't. We don't we're not a relocating company. Oh well, that, the guy on the phone didn't tell me that. Well, you gotta tell him. You gotta let him know, man, because. Uh, I can't take all this stuff, man. This puts extra weight on my truck. You know, you see what I'm saying? Yeah. I have to burn extra fuel because that's weight right there. Okay. Um, uh, I mean, that's, that's my car right there, too. I mean, I could put stuff in that car. And like, did, you, did you tell the company when you did well, yeah, I told him we're moving to, we're, I'm moving to Vegas, yeah, but... Yeah, but you're transferring your car, you have to do that transfer by the you know, I'm working. And another thing, man, I can't be responsible for this stuff. But if somebody breaks it, you know, I'm not, I'm going to be sleeping in the car, but, I mean, in my truck, but anything's possible, you know? What if I don't wake up and somebody breaks it and takes all your stuff? Yeah, I wish you would have told me. You got me. stuff in the trunk too? Yeah. Yeah? But it's pretty much shut, so. Okay, I'll tell you what, bro. You have to move some of this out. I can get all the stuff in that car, but. You transporting that too, or you No, I'm just driving it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah.
joking, man. No, it's fine. I can I can move some stuff. It's fine. You, you just need to step out of the seat, right? Yeah. Okay. I'll do it. Here's the thing. Sometimes, you know, I, I, I put car. If I put cars like if I put, if I put this down here in the back, yeah, it's then I have to, down. then I have to come out from the back seat. I, mean, I can't crawl over your stuff and stuff like that. Okay. Just uh, do me a favor, man. Clear my view and just this part right here. Behind the seat. Yeah, and then. You know those two things on top? You can leave the the, the box in the bottom. Yeah. Just clear my view and this, this over here so I can see you now. Okay. Leave the rest of it. You don't think anyone's gonna break into the car do you? Well, you know, anything's possible though. Yeah. You know, there's a lot of these out there. Okay. I sleep in the truck. I'm gonna be sleeping over here because I gotta pick up another one from Mazda across the street. Okay. Yeah. In the morning. But, uh, well, I, I was asking, I got really expensive food and I can put them in the car. Yeah, man, you know, yeah. It's, it's, you know, I don't know what you would do, but... Yeah, I would, I would just, I didn't even know. I would have put everything in that car, so... Yeah, Alright, I'll go do it. That's a nice car. Yeah, it's a Grand National. Yeah. Yeah, I love that thing. No. I've had it for five yeah. years. V6? Yeah, it's V6 turbo. 3.8. Yeah. Yeah. There's one over there at the uh, single deal. Yeah. At a, at a GMC deal. Yeah. It has original 100 miles on it. Really? Original. They're not selling it, but it's just in the showroom. Yeah. Just like this one. Original 100 miles. The guys, I don't know, they bought it? Worked out? Yeah. About 100 miles. <laughs> Crazy. Brand new, man. Imagine this car, brand new, sitting at a showroom. I like can't imagine that. But... Yeah. Very expensive car. I know. Beautiful. I put so much money in this thing over the past five years. I just, I have it. I just put it in brake system. Yeah. Bring it back in brake system. Yeah. I don't have to in my Yeah. I love this thing. That's a nice car, man. Yeah. I would, I would love to. My friend had one, too. Yeah. <laughs> Man, guy, that car is squeaking like a motherfucker. Huh. I think it's up there now, so let's see. Fucking Honda guy's going back to Vegas. <laughs> 